Uh, one second, hon. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, dogs and cats, elephants and zebras, gypsies and the she. Um, I want to say something to YouTube and Facebook, the people that own and operate these companies. You may be able to silence us on your platforms, but that doesn't mean we don't exist. Conservatives, libertarians, and so forth and so on, we exist. There are obviously more of us than you, but you're the ones who own and operate YouTube, Facebook, Google, etc. So you can silence us, but we're still here. And we're in numbers. We don't try to silence you. That you try to silence us and let's see if I still have it up I don't think I still have it up but uh, actually I can get it up really fast um, I will read uh, let's see where is it now, this is uh, actually not written correctly, originally, because remember, the Nazis were socialists. If you, people like it or not, they were socialists. This originally said, first they came for the communist. And I did not speak out, because I was not a communist. And they came, and this it didn't necessarily come from the trade unionist and all this, but it, then it says... This is the more popular version of the text. First they came for the socialist and I did not speak out because I was not a socialist. Then they came for the trade unionist and I did not speak out because I was not a trade unionist. Then they came for the Jews and I did not speak out because I was not a Jew. Then they came for me. And there was no one left to speak for me. So... And the Nazis did have unions. People don't realize that, but there were trade unions under the Nazis. But they were, like in, uh, in China or in the Soviet Union, they were unions that, trade unions that were sanctioned by the state. And only those sanctioned by the state. You could not have a private trade union under the fascist, under the communist, under the socialist. And you're not going to silence us. We're not going to be silent. Uh, New York State is trying to silence NRA members. And I do not support the NRA. I, I oppose the NRA. I support Gun Owners of America. But the NRA has and is supporting restrictions on our right to self-defense. And... You know, I'm thinking, should I really shut down my Facebook and YouTube, or should I keep them up? Because if I shut them down, then no one's going to hear what I have to say. But when I try to share or to post something that YouTube or Facebook dislikes or disagrees with, they won't let me share it. They take it down. Or I get tagged with some sort of a violation of something. YouTube has, has videos of, of gangs killing people, of hangings, uh, of, of torture. But if you show a gun, you get your, your channel taken down. If you're of the wrong political persuasion for YouTube, you get your videos taken down, you get your channel taken down. But if you're of the right political persuasion, you do the same freaking thing, and you can have it up. It's okay for the gangbangers to have their videos up, show them showing guns and shooting guns and shooting people. But for somebody like me who doesn't go around killing people, doesn't go around with violence, I don't commit violence. I haven't been in a, in a freaking fist fight since I was in high school. You know how long ago that was? I mean, seriously, that was a long time ago. 
we're talking several decades and you know I'm not committing violence but you want to shut me down because you don't like my politics 